Welcome everyone on my gaming channel, it is time for another game review. Cooking Fever, it's another free to play game and I just want to make this review to let you know, be careful, this is not actually the free to play game, this is more like a demo. And then later you're gonna be, be in a situation, if you want to accomplish this game, you will have to spend money on it. So let's have a look around. It's a nice music, nice design, game have a potential, it's just greedy. I don't like greedy games. That's why for this game, I can tell you straight away, is 3 out of 5. That's my score. My game reviews are different. I try to tell you some of the important stuff first and then you can not watching the rest of the video if you don't like it or you can just stay a little bit longer and then see how the gameplay is and how this look like but I'm warning you if you play this game you're gonna like it it's tempting to spend the money and get those diamonds and just uh, trying to proceed but actually the sad thing they are expensive because you need a lot of them there are some options to here to receive loads of coins. Definitely you don't have to you know, spend the money on the coins. No chance on this one. Uh, diamonds, you're also going to receive some, especially on the, on the beginning of the game. With your progress, experience as well, you get, you're receiving some amount of diamonds. But it's just nothing compared to what you need. Okay, uh, so there is some places here which is going to be in the next update. Coming soon. In the next update, hmm, after six months, it's still coming soon. I've been testing this game for a while, and I'm not the only one. I read some other reviews, I spoke with some other players who like this game. Uh, I want to make sure that everything what I'm showing here is not just my experience, but is players. Most of it is my point of view of this game, as I love to play games, I'm taking this very seriously. And I just don't like when the players are being cheated. The game need to make money. It's just that greed. A little bit too much. Here's why. Sometimes on some of the locations of this game, we will see challenge. I don't have it right now, but many times it's happening is challenge. And this is the first cheat. You will re win, for example, 15 diamonds and 10,000 or 8,000 gold. But you need to pay diamonds to get be involved in it or even if you're gonna win 30 diamonds and some gold coins I mean then you still will spend big amount of uh, those diamonds to actually win this how this works let's see this this location for example I've got 60 58% uh, on the kitchen upgrades and 66 on interior I can't proceed any further in this game like let's have a look I managed to get on the 40 level, yeah, accomplished all of it, but only on one star. So I've been losing a lot. Here you can see the three stars are up to 28. I will manage, I think, 29th. But this is going to be very difficult. You need to make those upgrades, and even if you're going to get your quota with the amounts of coins, you're going to lose too many customers during the process. So you will never get that three stars unless you're spending your diamonds on your kitchen upgrades and interior restaurants upgrades. I'm going to show you how this looks like. For example, in the first location is a fast food court. I got entire level on 40, so 40 stars or all three stars, all the levels. I'm going to show you the first mission. Even if you unlock everything, the coins always count. You can collect them. This is a very nice thing to do. You don't have to be worried about anything else except serving this stuff right now here. And you will receive tips, extra stuff. This information is for those who didn't play this kind of game. Um, let me talk about that cookie, what that cookie or cake depends on the location, some extra stuff, what they might want from you. It's, it's not worth to give it. It's definitely not worth to top up. Because you will have to spend your diamonds for, for them and it's really not not good thing to do. So we just have to wait. This first one is always slow because don't forget that you in the first mission you don't have this such equipment. You see I don't actually using too much stuff around here. So this is completely normal. 
I'm gonna earn far more, more coins than I need. I have far more customers than I need. But in time, everything really changes. That cookie's ready, really. I never wanna use them, this is totally a mistake. Uh, you got some basic uh, at the beginning for free, but later on, it's all changes. The game is fun, really fun. It's really a challenge. You might be clicking that mouse, you know, like a crazy. You need to be very fast. It's just those diamonds. Okay, okay done. Let's have a look around here. Earnings, that's one thing. Tips are very important because this total is, is helping you to actually accomplish the whole level. If you're gonna lose those customers, then it's a very big hit and you might not get those stars. Another bonus, every five or 10 levels, uh, you might getting the bonus, which is diamonds or coins or both. I don't even remember right now, but you're gonna get this stuff. So this is the very good thing my advice and try to accomplish on th three stars so the, your bonus is going to be higher if you're going to accomplish only one star the bonus is going to be just too low uh, it's worth to use that didn't lose any customers obviously this is just the beginning and then let's uh, see what kind of upgrades i've got around here they are plenty some of them on the beginning they are cheap you know, and they actually gonna give you, for example, like this one. You can see the extra clients, extra tips, blah, blah, blah. Extra time of waiting. And this is all important. There are plenty of around here to upgrade. Every restaurant got this, the same thing. And the same in the kitchen. But here, you don't have to actually upgrade everything to to accomplish the whole level on, on uh, three stars. You can see then uh, some of the stuff I actually ignore. Uh, focus on the price and things what really going to make the big difference for you. Uh, I think example here is very much like those uh, fries machine or Coca-Cola. Dispenser. This is definitely game changer. You need to making this quite fast. The customers are assholes, unpatient, you know, so you definitely need this. Let's have a look how this how this looks like here um, it's it's not difficult is this is the best level to actually trying to earn some extra coins and keep it that way let me try to do it fast Better to get yourself prepared before you're getting uh, extra customers. And my tactic is to take only the middle uh, coins, so you're good to go. So you, you know, you don't have to move your mouse around like a really crazy person. But this again all depends on which level, which restaurant you play. Sometimes I uh, need to get quiet and focus on this. As I don't want <clears throat> to disappoint anyone. So I still got uh, 11 customers to serve or more. If you're gonna burn any of your stuff, like burgers or something, then you need to bin it. And this is gonna deducting a small amount of coins, but sometimes it's count. Uh, so try to avoid this. And in faster you're gonna serve your food, uh, then better because you're making your customers happy and they are more willing to give you a tip. Yipes. Okay, so let's let's do this. Done. With all the upgrades, the earnings and everything else is quite in, quite good. 
you can uh, actually collect this and then we have an option to use the casino I suggest you straight away to bet only 500 coins uh, don't try to go lower because it's very rare then you're actually gonna get diamonds on this example I might spend 1000 right here and might get some diamonds and then another time I collect 50,000 coins spend it all and I didn't get even one so this really sucks it's very difficult to get it oh that's what you're gonna get you bet 500 you get 600 this is the most what we what we actually gonna win but if you're gonna be lucky and you're gonna get those diamonds it's better to to bet that 500 because the amount of diamonds is uh, far more higher uh, well I'm not going to show you this like you know getting all this 10,000 gone I don't even believe it I'm gonna get those diamonds Let's get one more and then proceed to the next one. You can play around and try, but believe me, 50,000, 100,000, that's a lot of playing on the burgers, serving them to collect that amount of coins. Uh, second location that I unlocked uh, was bakery. I made some upgrades here and there. I had no chance for me to actually accomplish this uh, without spending those diamonds on the, you know, full three stars. So I need to invest here if I want to accomplish this and this is might be a you know situation with that uh, stupid challenge if I want to do this uh, but except kitchen you also have to upgrade it here to have those extra uh, customers on the beginning this doesn't seem so bad when you see the amount three diamonds and 1200 coins it's nothing coins are nothing really because you're getting really fast you saw it yourself but this is just the beginning and you need really a lot everything you know the next level might cost you far more and then last level gonna cost you 10 or 15 diamonds and it's really rare or hard to earn those uh, so let's see this one this couch gonna get get us tip amount increased well that's actually a big good percentage so maybe worth it and we're gonna have 140 experience points I don't care about experience because if we're gonna repeat Playing the burger, we still getting get we getting that experience. So don't worry about that. And from one place to another, some of the stuff, uh, some of these locations are very hard, uh, like Hell's Kitchen. Very interesting. I wish to open this. It might be very crazy. Uh, let's have a look on uh, football. This is what I get uh, problems. Just to start, you, it's quite difficult everything is slow without upgrades if you're gonna do this you can see then i i can accomplish i think i can accomplish uh, level eight but depends which one they require different things so maybe in one they want more coca-cola another they request more fries or more sausages or something like that uh, let's try to go uh, accomplish 16th on uh, maximum level i'll go 575 coins that's not too bad it's all you know reasonable so we can just uh, try to do it but uh, I didn't play that game for a long time and it might be a little bit difficult for me right now and customers on this level are very very fussy so need to be fast those drinks without upgrades, so that's what I'm telling you. That's what you have to focus on. Uh, they are very cheeky with this. Very slow to make it. Oh, like this one. Now I ruin it. Good, he wants mushrooms and bread. Well, yay, I burn it. So you see, I got a business and a minus four. Still okay but could be better so what we're doing right now try to not give them food right away keep them happy if you have to wait for something like this guy so we're gonna give him here this one so this is gonna increase that level of waiting happiness or whatever that is and now we're gonna give it might help sometimes Upgrades are still the most important. Oh. 
Okay, so we prepare like this. And then we need two of that. Can't give them the drink separate. Try to keep him happy. No chance. He's gonna be gone. Even the time, let's not forget about this. And I still got one customer uh, left. Even if you will be fast enough and doing all these orders, like some of the players are far more better than me, you're still gonna get yourself in a position where you will have a massive problems, massive frustration, and this really hurt. When you keep trying, keep trying, because yeah, yeah we want to accomplish it. We want to have a, all this better way so use your diamonds wisely don't upgrade anything at, unless you need it and it's going to help you to proceed to the next level or higher stars that's my advice that's all what i can tell you actually later you're going to find yourself uh, you can read some other reviews on my description this is exactly what i wrote it down on the on the pc on the windows uh, s store that's my review and that's what i Keep it start, you know that way until they're gonna make the proper update, proper changes in this game. Uh, they could because there lots of people who like this kind of games. I've, I've really, I was looking forward to play all around. It's nice locations, nice options. Uh, so it's just that update with that diamonds. It's just making more j different challenges. Don't. To, this is the message to developer. To be honest. Don't be so greedy. That's all. Guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me the like if you did. You can place some comments if you have any other opinion about this or any other question about this game, this video or any other on my channel. More reviews to come, more gameplay to come. So make sure you're going to check out my channel, subscribe and see you next time.